Animated Mail. What just happened? Welcome back to the Animated Universe of Mail, and we're getting into episode number six of the Never Promised Land. Last episode ended with uh, Gilda and Don. They were sneaking in Mom's room. They discovered the hidden door by pushing a little the little case of books out the way. But as soon as they did that, they figured out it was locked and they couldn't get in it. And then someone else approached and came in. And that's what we're about to find out right now. So make sure you subscribed if you haven't already. Uh, check out my Discord. You know, follow that and, uh, you know, get into some discussions. And, yeah, man, let's get into this episode right now. Come on, who is it? What? What the hell is Phil doing? Holy crap, that little innocent-ass kid. Cute-ass little kid. Now they're trying to get intel on the outside. Become, they, becoming self-reliant and surviving outside. That, those are big steps. Now they just got to figure out outside, evade the pursuers, and get away from the farm. My Oh! He is on a swindle! He took the key! William? Oh my gosh, here we go. So she's been reading these damn books and there's like hidden messages. Also, it's Morse code. So he left Morse code in the book. The same owl, but it's a different thing. Man, they some kids. These kids are wild, man. Dude, these kids are wild. I feel like they about to get caught. And they about to get eaten. Farm. What are they going to find down here? It's just big ass libraries and more books. Oh, that's the bunny that Connie had. Oh, so he's probably going to find out that Connie's dead. Oh, I can't remember. Gilda and Don, they don't know that old boy's dead. That Connie's dead. And they're busy sitting here deducing these damn books. They were all snatched away from them by mom when they left. They weren't taken away by bad people. They were eaten. He just mistakenly bumps into it. She has intuition. Hey, you gotta trust intuition, man. Bruh, yes, they bad people. If they find out if mom or sister. What if mom is much more? Well, at least he can deduce the fact that they are hiding from them. It's the main, the main reason why he's doing all this shit. Y'all niggas need to just stay in y'all place. Trying to survive, man. Feel. Uh-oh. Yes. Don and Gilda are there. Holy shit. Y'all better be quiet. It's a wrap. She said, Mama, I found this on the floor. He heated. That must have been some improvising. Someone gave that little that key to that little kid and told him to give it to Mom. Yep, they on. They midnight snacks. Bruh, Ugh. you want the truth? I'ma tell you the truth, man. Yes, y'all midnight snacks, man. These little kids are guessing. They got some. These got. They got some intense mind games. This dude's got the break. He's oh, he's swinging on everybody. You can't hit a girl. Don't do it. Don't do it. Are we that weak and useless that you feel the need to protect? Now she. Now he's just taking everything and he. They just got cheeks marked. They got swollen all on their face. Are we family? Dude, I wonder if mom is going to know that someone was in that room. She has to. Bro, you are only like 11 or 12. There's no need to be want to become stronger, man. At least she honest. She's like, I have enough resolve to believe in you. My dude got stole on. They haven't showed the sister this episode. I wonder what the hell she planning. Yo, I punched you in the face, man. My bad. I'm sorry. He, he caught a left, Ray caught a left, and Norman caught a right. But hey, yo, at least they, they man, they mature enough to apologize. Sometimes you gotta acknowledge your wrongs to, you know, make things right. Who's watching them? Alrighty, we got two more. Two more down, down for the cause. Watch it, that sister. Watch it be sister watching. One week until that plan is carry out. Maybe they should leave and then come back. And Emma's still trying to figure out how to escape with everyone. And while meanwhile, Norman, he knows what Norman is trying to do. Well, he knows what Ray's trying to do. Herbicide and detergent. Bro, I wonder what they going to see when they get outside. That's what I'm excited for. Norman is trying to kill you. A hammer determined. 
The next shipment has been set. Damn, so the next shipment is gonna be Ray. Oh! Oh! Her creepy ass. Why is she so animated with her talking? Would you like to join forces? Holy crap. Who talks with spinning? Like, <laughs> she's talking like... The way the way the, ma the, the sister talks, she's talking like Sanji talks when he's like... Nami Swan and Rabbit Swan dance in the dawn and heart to die. No one realistically talks like that and dance like that. But granted, it's anime. They just doing it. I just think it's funny. It's hilarious. I'm enjoying it. I just think it's hilarious. But, man, this is getting down to the nitty gritty, man. This is like, it's like, you don't know who to trust. You don't know who to talk to. It's like backstabbing happening, man. I don't know. It's just like a, a mystery. You're trying to figure out, like, Ray's going to be shipped out. Uh, he's feeding her misinformation. He's t he told mother that there, he's planning to kill her, and that's the reason why he got punched in the face because they had a difference of opinion. When actually it was Don who did the punching and not Norman. Um, but I'm wondering what's um, what the mother is thinking because I'm sure she knows that Don is the one that bumped into her, and then the key ended up missing, and there you know. It's just there's a lot of there's a lot of sneakery going on and I'm loving it. We'll get to the bottom of it pretty soon, so hopefully you find out what next episode is going to bring. Since the sister is trying to make a little deal and trying to be on be in cahoots with, with the squad, with the squatty squad, you know what I mean? But let's see man. Make sure y'all subscribe, follow your boy, throw some thumbs, it's going up, check out my Discord, and I will see you beautiful people later. Alright? You all take care. And hey, don't forget. If there's no one else out there in this world that believes in you, I do. Bye bye. I don't think they know about me. I'm a beast. I'm a G from the 513. I never bite my tongue. I wasn't raised like that. Anything I want to say, I'm going to say it. That's that. Because I never hold back. If there's a problem, I'm going to say it to your face. Never talk behind your back. I'm going to give it to you straight.